What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Plague Inc. Evolved. So in this episode I'm going to be playing Virus on Mega Brutal. So last video I did Bacteria on Mega Brutal so if you haven't seen that be sure to go check it out. I'll put a link in the description. So anyway I'm going to start doing Virus. So you can just use whatever genes you have. I'm just going to use Terracite, Zero File, and Translation Plus I think. Um, so, yeah, just use whatever genes you have. I'm going to be doing it on Mega Brutal, and I'll just call it that, sure. So, start off with, I'm going to be doing kind of the same strategy as on bacteria, because a virus is just a bacteria that mutates more. So, it should be a pretty similar strategy. So, at this point, I have enough to get the... Rash. So, if you've already seen my other video, you probably already know the majority of what to do. But, anyway, so I'm going to be getting Rash first, and then I'm going to be getting Sweating. And the main goal of this is to get to Skin Lesions, which has a lot of infectivity. And also, it'll lead to Necrosis, which is going to be useful later on. So, Anyway, so we've already infected seven people in the UK, which is pretty good. So we're getting lots of DNA points while not infecting a lot of people. So anemia, what's that? No, I'm not going to devolve that because it costs three DNA points. I don't really think it's worth it to devolve right now. You want to devolve what's really necessary. You basically want to devolve things that are lethal. So if it's not lethal, you don't really want to worry about devolving it. So... There we go. Now I have enough for skin lesions. And as you can see, it says medicine in UK is long infection. That's good. That means that we're not going to infect the UK too fast and get noticed. So increased rainfall. So yeah, we're definitely going to want to get water one probably. So cysts. I'm not going to devolve that. The level one symptoms usually aren't too bad. If I did get something like fever though, which is lethal, I definitely would want to devolve that. So I'm going to get water one next and it said wet countries are getting wetter so it's gonna be really good to get oops okay so yeah and this is kind of the same strategy as the bacteria because that virus is for the most part a bacteria the strategy is pretty similar so hypersensitivity let's see what that is so hypersensitivity is right here so Let's see. That has a little bit of severity. Um, I'm going to keep that. That will. It says rich countries are vulnerable, so it should start spreading in the UK faster now, which is pretty good. So I'm going to get water one, probably. Or not water one, air one. Next. So, yeah, I just need to save up two more DNA points and then I'll have enough. Technology spreads to Central America, so that's pretty good. Or Central, yeah, Central America, right there. So, now we're starting to spread all over, and we still haven't gotten noticed, so hold on. So we just got insomnia. Insomnia is actually good, because it will slow the cure. Makes people irritable and less productive, which will slow the cure. So, now I'm going to get air one, since we have enough DNA points. And we're just trying to infect the entire world as quickly as possible. And then we're going to evolve necrosis and probably total organ failure once we have an infected person in every single country. And I think that's the best way to win, so hopefully I can do it. So yeah, we're getting lots of free symptoms. I'm going to go and evolve coughing actually now, just for a little bit more infectivity. And then we could even get nausea too and vomiting, and then we might get the projectile vomiting combo. So I think I'll do that next. You can see our infectivity is pretty high already. We still haven't infected that many people in the UK. It's still pretty minimal at this point. So paranoia. That will make people even less productive, which will help the cure, which will hurt the cure even further. So that's definitely not bad. I'm not going to devolve that. We're actually getting pretty good mutated symptoms. So I'm going to get vomiting or nausea and then I'll get vomiting next. So there we go. I'm going to get vomiting and hopefully we can get the projectile vomiting combo because that'll be really good. 
we probably will get it eventually. The sooner we get it, it will be better. Though. So, have they actually spotted us yet, though? Yeah, we haven't even been noticed. So, why? I don't know why it's doing that if we haven't even been noticed. We're probably going to get noticed soon, though, because the UK is infecting a lot. So, yeah, but we haven't even been noticed yet, actually. Here we go. Um, it's quite severe and must be infected for investigated further. Not good. Um, yeah, we definitely seizure symptom. Definitely not. And I actually haven't gotten anything here. So it's actually kind of worrying me that they're already start needing to cure me. So let me see. UK starts work on cure. Um, I'm gonna get some cold resistance. No, not cold. Heat resistance, probably. And we can start spreading to some of the more hot countries. There we go. Projectile vomiting combo. We're really infectious now. So, they're not starting to work on the cure really very much at this point. So, let me see. We have 80 million people. We do have some DNA points, so I'm going to get some drug resistance one. Then I'm going to try to get some more water, probably. By, yeah, I'm getting a water too. And hopefully we don't get cured. Doesn't look like they're really trying to start work on the cure yet. They have 1%. Spreading fast. Um, they don't seem too worried about the cure yet, though. And I think ours might be a little bit too severe. Because they're really trying to work on curing us right now, so. Pulmonary odemia. What's that? Hold on. Let's see what that is. So, abilities. Where is that? It's right here. So, it, it is lethal, so I'm going to devolve it. I don't want lethality quite yet. Again, we're just trying to infect every country, and it doesn't look like they're really trying to cure us very much yet. Cure progress is pretty slow at this point. So I am kind of want to get heat resistance, too, just so I can start spreading a little bit faster. And it does look like we've spread to a lot of the difficult countries to go to. More infectious than the common cold. It's good. Affecting most of the countries at this point. And we just we should just have to infect all the countries. Walking dead. There we go. Less productive. It's really good. So yeah, I'm just trying to save up a whole bunch of DNA points at this point. And I'm going to get, I think maybe drug resistance would be good. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. And then I'm just gonna save up at this point, because I need a lot of DNA points. Necrosis symptom. How many countries do we have infected? We still don't have every country. They're going to start working on curing us really fast if we get that. So I'm going to devolve that. And we do want to get that eventually. But hopefully we can infect a few more countries first. There we go. We really want to get Iceland though. There we go. There's Iceland. We still don't have Morocco infected, but we just have Bolivia and Morocco, which should be infected any second now. Yeah, I kind of have to start doing it, so I'm just going to go necrosis. Um, par paralysis makes it harder to cure. This, and then hopefully total organ failure pretty soon. Maybe that wasn't the best path, but... It will make it harder to cure. So I'm just going to try to make my disease really hard to cure now. Because if we can prevent them from curing us, that'll be really good. Let's go to symptoms. Um, seizures. Should theoretically make it harder to cure. So let's see. Inflammation. And there's one of the countries. People in Norway. That's fine. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to start getting some genetic reshuffles now. There we go. Killed more than the Black Death. There we 
here's the last country. And so at this point, I probably need to get genetic reshuffle. 38 DNA points. Almost have enough. That's fine. Whatever we evolve at this point is fine. We do have heat resistance too, though, so we should be fine as far as that goes. See? So, yeah, we're just getting a whole bunch of points, and as long as we don't get cured, we should be fine at this point. So, another genetic reshuffle. Just trying to slow down the cure some. And we're getting even more points now, so we should have enough to be able to, So, no healthy people left. We've killed the majority of the world, so at this point we've probably won. Um, so yeah, we'll just do another genetic reshuffle just to be safe. There's just only a few people left in the world, just like 300 million-ish, 200 million. So yeah, we've won at this point. So that's how you beat Virus on Mega Brutal. It's, it's not as difficult as it might seem. So anyway guys, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like. And if you really enjoyed it, be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.